show. You might have noticed that I talk a lot about how great plants are, and why shouldn't I? They're autotrophs. They can harness the raw, untamed power of the sun and use it to make food for themselves. Pretty impressive. So why can't animals do it? Well, oddly enough, some of them do. And in just the past few years, researchers have been discovering animals that seem to be able to harvest sunlight for energy. Take, for instance, the eastern emerald Alicia, a sea slug that looks like a big floating leaf. It lives along the east coast of the United States, where it just hangs out eating a specific kind of yellow-green algae. It's been known for a long time that this slug had a special relationship with the algae, but until recently, nobody knew that the slug was actually using the algae's genes for photosynthesis. See, the slug eats the algae to absorb its chloroplasts, the organelles in the cells that actually do the photosynthesizing. But in order to turn the sunlight into chemical energy, the chloroplasts need a whole set of specialized proteins to help. So the slug has lifted genes from the algae that allow it to make these proteins itself. Nobody's sure exactly how this happened, but we do know that these slugs pass those algal genes onto their little baby slugs, which only need to eat about two weeks of the year. The rest of the time, they're just soaking in the rays. Another photosynthesis.